Today I'm going to show you how you can go from aiming like this to aiming like this. I just stuck it in. Oh, crack right. Let's get right into it. Okay, so you want to improve your aim in Apex Legends. You're becoming a better player, but still losing important gunfights and just need that extra edge over your opponents. But look no further, because the answer lies in a little program called Kovax FPS Aim Trainer. Kovax is a sandbox game on Steam designed to help you improve your mouse control and aim through thousands of scenarios that mimic things you'll be doing in-game, whether that's close range fights, tracking a vertical target off an octane pad, or flicking quickly to a target after downing someone. There are scenarios in Kovacs to practice literally anything that could happen in game. Now one of the first questions I usually get is, wouldn't it be better to practice these things in game? To which I say, yes, but actually no. Apex Legends has a lot of downtime, as do most battle royales. Time that you spend looting, rotating to the next fight, etc. Some games you may play out a 20 minute game and only fight for a couple of minutes. Kovacs gives you the ability to practice things you need to improve upon instantly, as many times as you want, with none of the added pressure of choking that kill and losing the game for your teammates. It's literally like replaying that scenario where your aim could have been just a little bit better and practicing that over and over and over again until you get it perfect. I will note though that you can't just play Kovacs and be amazing at Apex. It's the combination of a good Kovacs routine and good practice on Apex that will get you playing like the pros. If you want more tips on how to improve on Apex without touching an aim trainer, click the like button and I'll dive into that in a future video. Kovacs is to Apex Legends like working out is to a sports player. The supplemental practice will strengthen your muscles and make performing when it matters easier. No more thinking about how you have to aim when you're in game, you'll just be able to zone in, hit that flow state, and dominate the competition. Alright, so hopefully I've convinced you that aim training is useful. Now I'm going to explain the fastest way to load out Kovacs and start practicing. First off, you're going to want to purchase the game on Steam by looking up Kovac, spelled K-O-V-A-A-K, and clicking the first link. If you don't have $10 to spend, you can aim train for free using AimLab. I'll link a useful resource in the description, but I would recommend Kovacs as all the resources and tips I'm going to cover in this video are on Kovacs, and I believe that it has more to offer in your training. Open up the Voltaic Kovacs Benchmarks document and give it a good read. I'm going to cover the essentials for getting started, but if you want the full breakdown from experts in the aim training field, that document has some amazing information. You're going to want to open the progress sheet and make a copy for yourself. This is where you'll store your high scores from scenarios and keep track of what rank you are. This rank isn't to discourage you or make you feel like a bad player. Don't be worried if you benchmark into a low rank. This rank is designed to give you scenarios that will be challenging enough to help you improve, but not so hard that it's impossible to play or causes you to build bad habits. The rank is based off of pure aiming skills and doesn't quite have the same weight as a rank in say Apex would where you have to factor in game sense, mechanics, positioning, and other in-game factors. I'll leave a download link to the routines you need to play to benchmark, which I recommend doing once a week or maybe once a month, depending on how serious you are about improving your aim. Navigate to this folder on your PC and paste the routines. Then play them out and record your scores into the progress sheet. Open the Fundamental Aim Training Routines document and scroll down to the section with the rank you scored from the benchmarks. If you didn't meet at least the bronze benchmarks, start with iron. Do these scenarios every time you get on, before you play, and be consistent. It's better to play 15 minutes a day, 4 times a week, than to play an hour a day once a week. You'll start to build better aiming habits and develop mouse control that will directly translate to your aim in game. For example, I benchmarked into Platinum, and now, before I get on every day, I do the Voltaic Platinum routines to help get my aim warm and also practice developing mouse control. If you need legitimate proof that this works, look no further than this video. I'm literally proof that aim training works. Sure, I put time into playing Apex and improving, but I also work a full-time job and go to school full-time. The amount of time I spend playing is less than some people, so I have to focus on practicing efficiently and effectively. I reach the top 1% rank every split and build my mechanics practicing solo pubs, 
which is a whole separate video. And it's steadily been improving since I switched to keyboard and mouse. If you follow these routines and benchmarks and start to aim train consistently, I promise you will be well on your way to becoming a human aimbot. I didn't start Apex as a naturally talented aimer. I had to build up my skill through hard work and dedication. And talent isn't always everything. I'm a firm believer that hard work beats talent when talent fails to work hard. And I know that you guys, if you put these routines to the test and you really care about improving, that you'll see improvement in your gameplay just like I have. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and learned something from it. If so, I'd really appreciate you dropping a like and comment on the video, which will push this video out to more people and allow more people to improve and get better at Apex. If you're new here and you want to see more Apex gameplay, tips, and guides, hit that subscribe button and ring that notification bell so you never miss an upload. All the resources I discussed in this video are down in the description below. If you have any questions or want to talk about anything related to improvement, aim training, keyboard and mouse, or literally anything, feel free to come out to my stream. I'm usually live every day around 8pm Eastern Standard Time. Hope to see some of you there. I wish you all luck in your journey of improvement, and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.